take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. If your frozen carrots go rubbery after being cooked, generally it's because the carrots were either old to begin with, or they were overcooked. It only takes 2 to 5 minutes to blanch the carrots, then plunge them immediately into ice water. Make your mark, take our lead! If you're in a rush and don't have time to blanch your baby carrots before freezing, you can actually freeze them raw, though they may lose some of their texture and flavor depending on how long you leave them in the freezer. Make your mark, take our lead! You can store them in plastic bags or the plastic bag they came in from the grocery store in the crisper drawer of your refrigerator for up to two weeks. To store them longer up to one month, submerge carrots in water in a container with a lid and place in the refrigerator. Change the water every four to five days. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark. You might enjoy crunchy carrots in a salad, but thawed, raw carrots are likely not best for that use. Blanched or not, the texture of vegetables changes when they are frozen. Frozen vegetables are best for cooked dishes such as soups, stews and stir-fries. Some frozen vegetables can even be roasted with good results. Make your mark, take our lead! Properly stored, frozen carrots will maintain best quality for about 12 months in the freezer, although they will usually remain safe to eat after that. Frozen carrots should be discarded if left for more than 6 hours at room temperature, as bacteria grow rapidly at temperatures between 40 degrees Fahrenheit and 140 degrees Fahrenheit. Make your mark, take our lead! It is now time to place them in either Ziploc bags or vacuum sealed bags, whichever you have available. If using Ziploc bags, it is very important to remove as much air as possible. Leave about 1 half inch to 1 inch of headspace in the bag to allow for expanding as the carrots will do when they freeze due to the water. Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. This recipe is intended to cook the carrots from frozen, so thawing them first will result in a mushy texture. Roast the frozen carrots at 425 degrees for 25 to 30 minutes, checking to stir flip every 10-ish minutes. You can cook them even longer for more caramelized crispy edges. Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. For carrots and beets, remove the tops the green parts because they will pull moisture from the actual carrot, making them dry and cracked. For smaller amounts, place unwashed carrots beets in Ziploc bags, seal tightly to ensure no air is coming in, and store them in the coldest part of your fridge. Make your mark, take our lead! Leave small carrots whole. Water blanch small whole carrots 5 minutes, diced or sliced 2 minutes and lengthwise strips 2 minutes. Cool promptly, drain and package, leaving 1 half inch headspace. Seal and freeze. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark. Yes, you can freeze cooked carrots for up to 9 months. 
They will retain their flavor and nutritional value, but lose their firmness and texture. It is best to blanch carrots before freezing, but you can also freeze carrots that are roasted, mashed, or mixed with other vegetables as well as carrot soup. Take our lead! Let's help you make your mark! Frozen carrots are a freezer staple in all their many forms, crinkled, sliced, diced, and spiralized. If you're like us, you already rely on them for quick sides, but these root vegetables are capable of far more than you might give them credit for. Here are 7 ways to turn a bag of frozen carrots into a meal. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.